Hi, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to do the Renegade kettlebell row with the push-up. Now, if programmed, you might have just the push-up and if programmed, you might just have the Renegade row. But what I'm going to be doing is showing you how to do the Renegade row and the push-up just so you can, you can kind of save time and not flick in between videos. So what we've got here is you're going to use to utilize the handles and utilizing the handles gets us more depth into the press, the chest press or the push up. Um, and the Renegade rows, it, I think it allows you to have more stability on your grip as well when you're trying to row. So when we're in this position, when we're in that Renegade row position, we want to have as wide a stance as possible. So if I can show you from this angle, you'll start to see that my feet, this creates more stability in my legs and in my core. If I get more narrow, it's more harder. So you can make this exercise harder and easier as you want, okay? So to do the Renegade Row, um, we are going to look to make sure body's nice and straight, driving one arm into the, into the floor and driving the elbow towards the hip line, elbows back. You will alternate, making sure that you are avoiding any twisting movements. We're trying to avoid any twisting movements. That will help because you don't want to, you'll lose tension in the back. You lose that whole core activation as soon as you twist. Okay. So sometimes how it looks on programming might, somebody might ask you to do maybe two renegade rows and maybe one or two free presses, chest presses. But for the chest press purposes, what you can do is if you are someone that is um, a beginner, you can be on your knees and you can go down and then you can press up. It's a lot easier using the kettlebells to do this rather than using uh, the floor because you can create more range of motion and it's more comfortable. For those that are more advanced, obviously being on your tiptoes, going down, driving up. Okay, the key behind it is mastering your push up before you feel that you can do the full push up on this because often enough you'll find people trying to use their shoulders to press, which can often put a lot of stress in the shoulders, which we're trying to avoid. But as you can see, the renegade row and push up, I'm gonna do that now for you and how it would look is that's missed me doing one 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 but it will just depend on what is programmed for you specifically but hopefully that makes sense and if you have any questions on doing those, those exercises please feel free to drop me a dm